All work and no play can make for a dull snowmobile, but in recent years, sleds like the Polaris Titan have kind of blurred the lines between work and play. And now you've got Skidoo for 2020 entering the mix with their own Expedition Extreme. Now to talk about both these sleds, here's a candid conversation between Rich and I about these two epic snowmobiles. All right, so here we go with the comparison between the Polaris Titan and the Skidoo Expedition Extreme. Again, two sleds that are very, very similar on paper and actually in reality too. Yes, no, absolutely. I thought they were very similar. Both 20 inch tracks, yeah. good flotation. Still surprised they can go where they can go. Lots of Top power. of the line suspensions in both. I mean, you, you, if you didn't know you were on a sled with a 20 inch track, and you wouldn't know. I mean, it does feel like you're riding a Clydesdale on both of them. Your feet are way yeah, they're, far apart. they're definitely big. Um, but not a bad trail slide. Like, no. we went out, we've been riding with one all year round last year, the Titan, the yeah. Titan last few years. Yeah. And I mean, they run 72, 75 miles an hour. Oh, yeah. Out. Yeah, a little bit more maybe. But if the, you're all not the carrying... gear that you could put on the back was incredible. Oh, you can run down. The thing weighs a thousand pounds going down the trail at 75 miles an hour. You could have used a better brake, I think. It, it does tax the braking system on both, I think. But it's not- trying to slow that weight yeah. down, but- But it's not your dad's old station wagon. Like, it, no. it's a badass looking snowmobile. It's so cool to ride, both of them, right? Yeah. If you're riding either one of those things, The XC cool. Titan, blacked out, medium smoked windshield, yeah. QS3 shocks. I mean, it was a great sled. The only thing is, is that when you went off trail with it, it stayed on top of the snow. Yeah, it wasn't, it had great flotation, which mm -hmm. is what it's supposed to have, but wasn't real super friendly if you're trying to do a powder hook or something like that. No, no. Now, the Expedition Extreme is that same, I mean, it's it's very Titan-esque. Yep. Um, I think maybe slightly higher in performance levels when it comes to, um, you know, it, it's it's banging through the- The trail, the chatter. trail, yeah, or, I mean, we had Scallop and he was doubling that thing. Yeah. You know, and I, I think it's slightly better in that circumstance. I think the Titan maybe is a little faster. Mm -hmm. So again, very comparable to, to, to I felt there was more one. storage available, like more options available on the Expedition. And that bumper kit, Jeff, I don't know if you noticed that wraparound front bumper was, th yeah. that is the baddest ass bumper that you can find. That that Expedition Extreme in, in red with, yep. with the accessories that are on it, I mean, it is, it is a pretty nice yeah. looking sled. I agree with that. And I also think that with the added accessories that they gave. Because the big thing for me were, was the accessories available that Skidoo had. Like yeah. you could turn that snowmobile into anything that you wanted. It could be oh, yeah. a woodcutter, it could be a, a fishing buggy, it could be anything, right? Hunting. And then when you wanted to strip all that stuff off, both of them were very, very capable snowmobiles on the trail. Excellent trail manners. I yep. mean, they would do anything you needed them to do on the trail. Both of them would throw a rooster tail at the back that you really don't want to ride behind it for about a hundred yards. Yeah. <laughs> it was crazy. But uh, but yeah, like, you don't have to ride them with a paper bag on your head. No, there's they're, nothing to be shameful about those no, two No, those are, those are cool sleds. And super capable if you wanted to do, you know, I think if you had like a big uh, overnight tour, you know, yep. three or four destinations, and uh, we did that with the Titan on yep. a number of occasions, everybody, put their junk on your sled though. That was kind of the only drawback to the Titan is you were you were the pack mule who carried everything. <laughs> but it would do it and and it would keep up with the crowd. Oh, as a boy. matter of fact, it would lead the crowd in a lot of cases. And uh, although we haven't had that opportunity with the Expedition Extreme, I feel it would be exactly the same. So you're like the UPS plane <laughs> taking off to the next stop. <laughs> yeah, and, and the great thing when- uh, My with, bag, sir. Well, with On Snow in the magazine, yeah. we can pack at least five boxes of magazines on the back of the Titan. <laughs> right. And it does work really well to have that counterweight back there because it'll wheelie forever. <laughs> and again, I think the Expedition Extreme will do the same thing. I agree with that. I think the Expedition is a great sled. 